Good morning, Arthur. You okay, Abigail? Settling in. Good. How you doing? All right, well, I should be getting on. All right then, Arthur. How are you? In a lot of pain. Can't do much work. Well, tomorrow's another. Good morning, Arthur. Hey. So that feller who was hassling you at Valentine. I'll tell you another time, okay? Okay, sure. Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss? You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Flown in. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss him so much.
Take a look at this. Look at this, my friend. Tobacco. Nature's gift to us all. Hmm. Focuses the mind like nothing else. Whatever you say. Well, I say, why buy it off the shelves when you can make your own? Well, plenty left here if you're interested. I'd best keep moving. Fine eye, mister. Knock, knock, Mr. Rudd. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh. a German. Uh, um, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the Kaiserreich. I don't speak German neither. I'm here for money, money that you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, no. No, nie, nie. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu, znajdę ci pieniądze. Oh, still don't understand you. God damn it, you have a debt to Herr Strauss. Pay up. Stop! Już nie mam siły. Ah, no, 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 please, no, don't have money, but, but I have this, it's, it's good, it's good, it's valuable, it's, it's Warsawa, yes. I have your things, okay? I have anything in here or out there? Yes. Don't even speak English. You must have come here with something. Uh, 
very valuable. Good? Not good yet. Longer I look, the madder I get. No, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. I need, I must eat, Frozen. Okay, that should about cover things. What you got behind there? So, uh, Move aside. What do we have here? Just keep quiet. There's a girl. Follow me, boy. Hey, mister. I just want to be left alone, all right? You care about this girl? Stand up for yourself. She'll come around. Yeah? I've been waiting. Trust me, kid. There ain't so many good men out there. Make yourself one of the good ones. Thanks, mister. I hope you're right. Yeah. 
You wait, Lily May. Well, someday, I'll show you. I'll be rich. Mr. Arthur, I told Dutch I feel I should tell you. I saw some of Combs boys riding around. Down here? What they want? I have no idea. They see you? I don't think so. Okay. Well, thanks for letting me know, Kieran. Mm-hmm. Why don't you move next time? For the world. That's what I like to hear. Hosea. Hello. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. <laughs> Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. Come on, girl.
Hello there. Is that horse doing all right? Now, I'm happy to stable that for you. I heard about that. No papers, huh? Well, I can't give you full property. Holler if you need any of them. Just get one seven. All right, boy. Hello. Mr. Thomas Downs, you owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir, I'm, I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Oh, please, I have a family, sir, please. I don't care about your family. You have to be more reasonable. Now, wouldn't paying up have been a little easier? If you want the money, you'll have to wait. Why'd it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir. Pay the money, you'll make this stop. <sighs> you borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife or your family or something. 
We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman. My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. <laughs> 